boat here in just a moment, and then we'll be back under the American ethanol green flag. Just a couple of laps remaining. Here they come, down to the stripe, looking for the green flag as they begin to come up through the gearbox, hard onto the accelerator. Green flag is in the air. Ryan Blaney gets a pretty good jump and plenty of drafting help as he gets a shove from behind by Trevor Bain. Blaney in the outside. Trevor Bain right up the middle. Ricky Stenhouse in tow. There's still three wide. Chase Elliott on the inside. Give Trevor Bain the lead. What a bold move off turn number two, but he's under fire. Chase Elliott looks to the low side. Side by side, trading paint across the stripe. The restart was under review. NASCAR deemed that Ryan Blaney jumped the restart. However, the battle for the lead is in turn two. And it is Chase Elliott looking to the inside of Trevor Bain, the new race leader, off of turn two and up to that straightaway. Yeah, Trevor Bain doing a great job now as we are, uh, the field slows down into turn number three. Caution flag is on the speedway. A couple of cars got together up in turn two, and I think it was Ricky Stenhouse and Kyle Larson that traded some paint yet again. Caution flag is out. First segment is over, and Trevor Bain will take the direct transfer into tonight's NASCAR Sprint All-Star Race. With a bold move that he did make over there in front of you, Kyle, and finished it over on the back stretch. Now everybody was watching the, uh, the, the Chase Elliott and Ryan Blaney running side-by-side -side for the race lead, and there was just enough room between them, and Trevor Bain got a great run off of turn number two and onto the back straightaway as 